so so let me just get this straight okay so you're running the guns like i told you to yep cobblepot took them and it went off without a hitch yep and then you proceeded to get your ass beat by a child in my defense he was really good at fighting He's fucking ten, Bill! He had a stick! And you had a gun! Batman was with him! Oh, no, no, yeah, you're totally right. Just one question, did you get beat up by Batman? Uh, no. No, no, who'd you get beat up by, Bill? The, the kid. The kid, yeah, for fuck's sake! Hey, cut me some slack, man. Scott got beat up too. Scott got beat up by a seven-foot-tall, leather-clad, body-armor-wearing mountain of rage and fear with tree trunks for arms. You got beat up by a fucking middle schooler in a red t-shirt and green short shorts. Fuck you, man. I get your point. At least tell me you tried to fucking hit him. That's fucked up, man. He's ten. We're so fucking dead. Bill, why are you in the hospital again? I took your advice. What advice would that be, Bill? You know damn well what advice. Yeah, okay. Let's run through tonight's event, shall we? Hmm. Uh, you were running the second shipment of guns. Yep. And who showed up again? Batman and the kid showed up again. I'm sorry, what? Batman and the kid showed up again! Batman and the kid, right! Hmm. Uh, but you didn't take a fucking beating from a child this time, did you? No, I did not. No, Bill, what did you do? <coughs> I kicked the shit out. You kicked the shit out of a kid, yeah. <coughs> <coughs> And what happened directly because you did that? <coughs> oh, fuck. Batman did unspeakable things to my bones. Batman did unspeakable things to your bones, yeah. What did we learn? Don't fuck with the kid. Do not fuck with the kid. The kid in green scaly boy shorts shows up, take the fucking fall. I'm sorry, what? I said if a kid in green scaly- No, 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 I, I heard you did- What? Oh yeah, and if he's followed around by a black leather demon, take the fall from him too. Should... Should I fight back? Oh no, you don't want to fight back. Bill, does he want to fight back? You tell me, asshole. Fuck happened to him? Ah, the Batman stole his bones. The Batman did what? Bill, we've been over this a million times. What the fuck do you mean he stole your bones? No oh, so that's how Batman stole your bones. Oh yeah, you're totally covered, don't worry. Uh, I used to have this buddy, Bill, God rest his soul. Batman stole all of his bones. Twice. Yeah, we're still not particularly sure how he did that. Hey boss, what you want me to do with all these creepy ass fi- Oh shit. <laughs> and I just got insured. Uh <laughs> no, Bill, we totally understand that you've had two fucking femur replacements in the last year from getting your shit locked by Batman and Robin, but no! Gotta send you and go get the guns, can't send Ted, no, fuck that, no, gotta send Bill. Should've signed a better contract with the Goonion, Bill, of course. Fuck me, gotta send fucking Bill, buddy, how you doing, how's the femurs? <sighs> shit. Hey, Nightwing. That's great, I'm glad to hear it. I heard you got into the Goonion, too, That that's really, really good for you. Say, I don't suppose that you legally bought these guns, did you? No, I, uh... I, uh, I don't suppose I did. Yeah, yeah, no, I didn't, I didn't think so. See, here, here's what I'm gonna do for you, here's the deal. I'm gonna bop you one real fucking good, just so the Joker doesn't fucking kill you for giving up these guns without a fight. Yeah, yeah, no, he, w he would do that. However, after he's arrested, I'm gonna come back and arrest you without taking any bones as trophies. Does that sound good to you? Sound like a plan? Don't suppose I'm gonna get a, uh... Better deal here, so yeah, yeah, sure, just, just right here. Awesome, again, congratulations on the Goonian, that's real good for you. Ten and a half foot tall, double-sided coin- Where the fuck am I supposed to find that, Harvey? Hey, Bill. Fuck, hey, Red Hood! But what did I tell you about running with Two-Face? He told me it was a lot like his gun. It could really easily BACKFIRE! Haha, <laughs> 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 bitch! <laughs> really? Really, Bill? Ah, son of a- Bitch. Man, why you gotta go and do that? I was just gonna fucking pistol whip you and leave you here. Now I gotta take your fucking kneecap. Yeah, yeah, no, that, that makes sense. And did you seriously use a one-liner on me when you stole my fucking gut? You know what? Fuck it. I'm taking both of them. Wait, 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 no! <laughs> why the fuck do people keep setting up arms deals in this exact location? The Joker, the Two-Face, the Penguin? Fuck, I mean, I can't... Shit. Hey, Bill. I... Can explain in a totally legal sense why I'm here. No, you can't. No, you're, you're right, I can't. Hey, weird hypothetical question. Which one do you use more, your arm or your leg? The fact that you feel the need to ask that terrifies me, but I, I mean, I, I guess my leg? Interesting answer. Also, that goes first then. <laughs> oh, god damn. <laughs> I don't know why the fuck the Riddler sent me here, but I know there's a Robin around this corner right here! <laughs> oh shit, Bill, you caught me. What a shame. That's right, finally I caught one, you little motherfucker!
You just got my hand off? Yup. Yeah. Ah. I see. Yeah, to be perfectly candid, I hear some fucking wild stories. Who the fuck steals both of someone's femurs? Oh yeah, you think that's bad? I should tell you about the time where his kid cut my fucking hand off. His kid did what? And over there is where we keep all of our weird novelty masks that we use for robberies. Oh, huh, good to know. Yeah, and with that, I think the tour of the evil layer is complete. You, uh, you got any questions? Yeah, just like one. If I'm on like lookout duty and I spot a super of any kind, what what should I do? Yeah, well, seeing as we're in Gotham, usually you only really have enough time to go. It's the bat, and then all of a sudden you wake up in the ICU. No, okay, fair, makes sense. However, if he leaves you for seconds, there is actually a color coded system that we use. Oh shit, really? That sounds efficient. Yeah, yeah, it is. Yellow circle usually means that he's in a pretty good mood, and you're probably gonna keep your kneecaps. I, I would like to keep my kneecaps. Yeah, I remember I said that the first time too. No yellow circle. If it's just a black bat, you're. You're probably fucked. You're probably gonna lose a couple of bones. I'm sorry, lose bones? Yeah, yes, lose bones. Keep up, kid. If it's any variation of a red bat, spiky or otherwise, don't bother screaming. We will probably hear the gunshots before you even have time to get something off. Hold the fuck up. I thought bats had a no-gun rule. No, 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 no. Batman has a no-gun rule. Batwoman? Not so much. Oh, so essentially if it's just anything other than a yellow circle bat, I'm fucked. Oh, no, 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 no. If it's like a blue bird or like a blue V symbol, you're, you're, you're good. You're just gonna get a couple of bruises and then get sent home. Well, at least there's like another option. Yeah, but his turf's Bloodhaven, so I wouldn't really count on that one. If it's a yellow bat, I would probably be worried. Why, is there something special about that one? I mean, like, the, yeah, kind of. There's a couple of them. If she's got red hair, you're probably gonna get the shit kicked out of you. It's basically the same as getting the shit kicked out of you by Batman with no yellow circle. If it doesn't have any hair and no mouth, don't even bother screaming. Same rules as Red Bat. You're probably gonna be dead before we can say anything. Oh, so the yellow bat's just bad fucking news then. No, 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 no. She's got blonde hair, you're fine. Don't worry, you can kill that one. Okay, so like yellow bat's just like a, a sometimes scared then? I mean, yeah, basically. The yellow bat follows the R rule. I'm sorry, the R rule? Oh shit, yeah, I guess I should explain the R rule. The R rule is basically that every single Robin has their own fucking deal. So like, if, if the R is blocky, you're probably not gonna get beat up that bad unless the kid looks really fucking mad. Then, then you, pro you might get thrown off a roof. It's either not not bad or thrown off a roof? Yeah, yeah, you kind of just have to judgment call that one. If it's a spiky awe with no yellow circle, then you're probably gonna get hit in the face with a metal pole a couple of times. This is so much. Yeah, I mean, and the same rules apply for a yellow bird on that one, just that one's gonna hit you a little bit harder. Wait, I thought we were talking about the R's. Isn't this a Robin thing? Yeah, we are. That one's just the same Robin. Keep up. If it's got one spike, you're probably gonna die. That one has a sword. One of them has a sword? One of the Robins, yeah. And I mean, like, Red Hood does also, but, like, only sometimes. Okay, and he's one of the, the Red Bats, right? Yeah. Oh, or sometimes he's got like this red V mask design too. Oh, and don't forget that sometimes his design's a little bit closer to a red bird. Oh yeah, and sometimes it's like a red bird design on his chest. Okay, good, good to know. Thanks, man. Oh yeah, don't mention it. Yeah. No oh, shit! Dude, you're good? What? I asked if you're good, dude. You look like you're losing your shit. No, yeah, man, I'm fine. It's just, it's fucking cold out here, you know? Shouldn't smoke that shit, you know. Yeah, yeah, whatever. You sound like my fucking doctor. It's probably because your doctor has a degree and is smart. Yeah, yeah, whatever you say. I need to warm up. How do you not feel how fucking cold it is, man? Oh, I lost the ability to feel temperature after Red Hood lit me on fire. I'm sorry, after Red Hood did what? Lit me on fire. He used to do that in the early days. You're giving me medical advice after you've been lit on fucking fire. I've also lost all the bones in my legs. Excuse me? Oh, yeah. More than once. Bone replacement's a bitch. Bro, how the fuck are you not fucking dead? Oh, it's simple, really. Hey! Go to my yearly checkups, I take my vaccines, and I don't fucking smoke. Alright, yeah, yeah, get your fucking point. Oh, and I also do my best not to piss Batman off. By the way, he's out tonight, so have your gun ready. Oh, trust me, you ain't gotta worry about that, I got it right here. I'm sorry, where do you have it? Right here, man, I got it tucked up front for easy access. Ah, uh, yeah, don't keep it there. I'm sorry, what? I'm telling you, man, you don't wanna fucking keep it there. Alright, so let me get this straight. I can't smoke, and I can't keep my gun where I want to. What exactly can I do? What I fucking tell you, and what I'm telling you is that you don't want to keep your gun there when Batman's out. Oh yeah, cause Batman's gonna shoot me in the dick. What? What are you fu- No. I'm telling you man, you make that mistake one time. No, no, cause see now I know you're fucking with me, cause Batman's got a no gun rule. No he doesn't. Yes he fucking does, everyone knows that! No, he really doesn't. You fuck you, yes he does. If he didn't we wouldn't be guarding this fucking door because Black Mask would've been dead years ago. No, 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 Batman has a no killing rule. What? No, no, no. You see, he's fine with guns. Red Hood uses guns. Commissioner Corden uses guns. Bluebird, Batwoman, so many of his people use guns. Son of a bitch, that makes sense. His big thing is about, like, killing people. He doesn't mind the actual using of guns. Don't get me wrong, he doesn't personally like using them, but if one is presented by some dumbass wearing it as a fucking codpiece... Well, 
This is bad luck on your part, isn't it? Nah. Nah, nah, you're full of shit. Alright! No, you're just trying to fucking scare- You're fucking with my head! Yeah. Yeah, sure, kid. No, you're just as cold and bored as I am, and you just want to have some fucking fun- Where are you going? Have fun, uh, testing your theory. And what the fuck is that supposed to mean? <clears throat> This wouldn't happen to be yours, is it? Oh, I fucking warned him. Okay, um, juror number two, please state your name. Uh, yeah, yeah, my name's, my name's Bill. Just, just Bill. And what do you do for work? I'm, uh, in independent contractor, independent contractor, yeah. And where is it that you live? Uh, c co company housing. Alright, final question. Do you believe that there's any reason that you should not be a part of this jury? You mean, other than the fact that I don't want to fucking be here? No, no, I think I think we should be good. Alright, thank you very much, sir. Uh God, I hate morning patrols. At least not night patrol. At least I'm not getting hit by Batman. Although I do need to wake up early, so I might actually prefer getting hit by Batman. Hey man, boss just called, said I'm gonna be guarding the door with you tonight. Yep, sounds good. Whoa, hey, where's your, where, where's your mask, man? It's Excuse me? Last time I checked, we're still in the middle of a fucking pandemic, man. There's a mask mandate. Where's your, where's your fucking mask? Okay, who, who fucking cares if there's a mask mandate, man? We're villains, we're henchmen, we're evil, man. We break the law all the time. It's literally our job. Yep, yeah, villains and we break the law, but we're not fucking stupid. We still listen to science. Okay, maybe you do. What the actual fuck are you talking about? We're working for a super scientist right now. That is Mr. Freeze in there. You don't be so fucking paranoid. Tell me that a henchman in Gotham City did not just tell me to not be paranoid. Okay, fucking whatever. I'm still not wearing a mask, dude. Yes, the fuck you are. I'm gonna report your ass to the Goonian. Oh, fucking come on. Seriously, dude? Absolutely. I am more concerned about my and everyone else's safety than your fucking friendship. Go put on a mask or you're getting reported, asshole. Fine. Fuck. God, you're a prick. Yeah, right. I'm sorry for caring about the people around me, you fucking heartless asshole! I fucking like wearing these things. I just want to get this shit over with. He's at least fucking vaccinated. Jesus, just for his sake. You have to go and buy one from the fucking 7 Eleven? Where the fuck is he? Alright, I got a mask, you fucking asshole. Good, it's about fucking t are you fucking kidding me? What? You said a mask. This is a mask. You know good and goddamn well that I meant a face mask. Well, sorry that I don't carry medical grade face masks everywhere that I go. Yes, because the Cobra Commander helmet is so much more reasonable than just having your car. Why do you have that? I'm a hench for hire, okay? The Goonian basically just sends me where I need to go, and the last place that I went was the goddamn Cobra headquarters in Springfield. Wait, so that's another villain's henchman gear? That's even more reason you can't fucking wear it. What do you want me to wear a fucking mask or not? Fuck's sake, I would just loan you a mask. Just take the helmet off. You're telling me you made me go through all of this and you could have just loaned me a mask the entire fucking time? You're in year two of this motherfucker. Everyone has a mask. I did not think that I was going to need to give you one or you were going to wear a fucking cobra helmet. Take it off. Jesus, fine. Fuck. God damn it. I'm fucking believable. What fucking now? It, it, it stuck. What? God damn it. It fucking stuck, okay? How the fuck did you make it out of training? Are you gonna fucking help me or not? Fuck, here! Thank you, God. There's a latch in the back. Here, look. Yep, there you go. I think you got it. There, there. Alright, jeez. Awesome. Thank you. Go oh, fuck! Oh, it's nice to know they're at least staying safe. Well, time to fix that. <laughs> Holy shit, Bill! What? Holy shit, Bill, it is you! I, it's Todd from high school! Oh, hey, man, what's up? I haven't seen you in forever. This is great. How you been, man? Ah, you know, I got this freelance thing. I'm working where I can. How about you? How have you been? Ah, well, I, I, I mean, to, to be fully honest with you, man, I'm not, I'm not doing so great. I'm, I've just lost my job a little while ago. I've been trying to, to find work where I can. Man, I've been there. That sucks, dude. I'm sorry. You know, actually, thinking about that, it's, it's a good thing that I ran into you. I heard, I, I heard you got into to, to henching, right? Yeah, what about it? See, the thing is, oh, yeah, sorry, cut you off and everything, but uh, there is a potential that I know more supervillains than the Legion of Doom, so if you are wearing a wire, they will never find your body. Potentially, of course. Okay, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm not wearing a wire. Okay, good. Then you got nothing to worry about. Go ahead. Oh. Okay, uh, well, I, since I just ran out of work, I was, I was thinking of, I was thinking of picking up a henching, you know? Okay, 
Okay. It's a really rough career to get into, just to let you know. There's a ton of onboarding processes. Supervillains all have their own hiring things. There's the Goonian that you got to sign up for just by obligation. I'm sorry, did you just say the Goonian? Yeah. Yeah, it's called the uh, First Universal Henchman's Union. We just called the Goonian for short. Sari Malum Stequartudo. Do that shit safely. Here, we got t-shirts. You want one? Yeah, sure. Why the fuck were you carrying a shirt on a hand? Do you just fucking carry these fucking things around to hand out? <laughs> you know, sometimes. I mean, you never know when an opportunity will arise to, um, advertise. Uh, who are you talking to? Oh, no one. Side effect of getting hit in the head too many times. What are you thinking of Henshin? Oh, well, you know. I was thinking of picking an easy city to start with, you know? Probably good plans. So what, like small fry superheroes, low numbers, that sort of thing? No, no, no. I mean, more like it would be super easy to get a job. I already don't like where this is going. Yes, yeah, so like I was thinking I was going to start with Gotham. What? You know, I had completely forgotten until this exact moment that you never fucking graduated. What? What are you talking about? You know, there's easier ways to tell me that you're a fucking masochist. What? It's like the most crime-ridden city in the world! And it's also patrolled by the Bat Family! Oh yeah, like the father and son duo is gonna patrol the entire city and end up kicking my ass. How many members of the Bat Family do you think there are? I don't know, I don't fucking keep tabs on the city! It's like Batman, Robin, and like Batgirl sometimes, right? Ow! Don't you ever insult me to my fucking face again. What are you talking about? I didn't say anything! Tell me, are you trying to pat out your resume with skills like can get his ass kicked by an entire orphanage full of pantsless children? What the fuck does that even mean? How many bones are you willing to lose for this job? I, I don't want to lose any limbs. I didn't say limbs, I said bones! That seems a little dramatic. Gotham is a little dramatic! Alright, but like I still want- Shut up! No, okay, the only reason that I work here is because I'm good at my job, I know what I'm doing, and I fucking live here. If you want a good henching gig, go work for LexCorp. They'll probably give you a 401k, and hey, their superhero won't put you in the fucking hospital. Jesus, I've had less stressful conversations with actual fucking- Fucking narcs, goodbye! Hey, Jesus, see ya, man. Yeah, that was a bust. Yeah, he didn't really give you anything, did he? Well, that's not true, I got a t-shirt. Oh, yeah. Great police work. Come on, break, fuck off! For fuck's sake, god damn it! I said that I was on my br- <laughs> Fuck happened to you? Batman kills people now. <laughs> Excuse you, what?! Yeah, Batman, uh, the big, big dude, dark colors, big, big ears that look like horns, white eyes, yeah, that dude just, uh, dropped, dropped that off a roof. You've gotta be fucking kidding me. Is that all? Come on, man, you've been dropped off a roof, I've been dropped off a roof, that's Batman's M.O., he does that to everybody, he just breaks your legs and leaves you there for the cops to get you. Yeah, true, 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 but, uh, see, see, thing is, we, we were trying to break into, like, Wayne Towers, so we were, like, uh, 73 odd stories up, and he just fucking... Woo! Uh, it fell off the side. I, I don't think his legs are broken. You got something to drink around here? I'm, I'm kind of shooken up. No, man, this place is good, you know. There's no alcohol allowed in the facility. This, this, this doesn't sit right. That, that, that's not Batman's thing. Well, it apparently is the fuck now because he killed Ted and then he flew off into the night sky screeching like a fucking banshee. Okay, see, now I know you're fucking with me because none of the bats can fucking fly. Yeah, you know what? You're right. You're totally right. You fucking caught me. I'm fucking with you. It's the other seven foot tall, muscle bound mountain of a man with glowing white eyes and horns and giant fucking wings fucking around with the criminals of Gotham. Listen, you tweaked out little fuck, I don't care what the fuck you saw, Batman doesn't fucking kill people, and I, of all people, should fucking know that! Oh, well, do you wanna go to Wayne Tower and mop up the fucking stain that used to be Ted then and tell me it wasn't him? You better watch who the fuck you're talking to! Yeah, fuck you, man, I know what the fuck I saw- <laughs> Oh, holy shit! Holy shit, did I just kill Batman? See you, man, I fucking told you, I told you it's- Shut up, shut up, shut the fuck up, let me just fucking check the body, okay? I told you, man, I fucking told you, I knew it! Oh, please don't be dead, please don't be dead, please don't be dead, please don't be dead, please don't be dead. Oh, thank fuck. It's not him! The fuck you mean it's not him? Look at him! Dude, I'm telling you, trust me, I've seen Batman up close, and that is definitely not fucking Batman, and you should be over the fucking moon about that shit. I t you mean to tell me that there's actually two of these motherfuckers now? Ah, I mean, there was, but now we're just back to one again. How the fuck does one city get two fucking bat people? Oh, you must be new, that's cute. Welcome to Gotham, it's a little bit dramatic. This, uh, isn't out of the normal. Jesus Christ, I need to move back to Metropolis. Probably a good plan, yeah. Ah! Okay, we're back to-